going to be cold. It will be dry for the morning commute. As we move into the afternoon hours, the evening hours, we could see that freezing rain continue to lift up towards the north, impacting areas along and south of I-70. Some folks, the evening rush could be a headache. So if you could get out of work an hour early, tell your boss that I'm telling you this, not a bad idea. It could be in your in your help to get out of work early and hit the roads before the evening rush happens. All right, now towards tonight, light freezing rain continuing south and along of I-70, some spots north of I-70, and then by Saturday afternoon, mostly cloudy skies. We do have a time frame window of where we could be seeing drier conditions, which is good news. That will give our road crews enough time to get outside and get rid of the ice that we could see late Friday night into Saturday. But the freezing rain on late Sat or late Friday into Saturday looks to be light. As we go into Sunday morning, that's when the bulk of the freezing rain will be arriving. This is when we could be expecting significant ice and it will eventually transform to over into rain by Sunday afternoon. So let's quickly but very carefully go day by day over the weekend. Friday, dry morning commute, light freezing rain after lunchtime, less than a tenth of an inch, so light freezing rain. Saturday morning off and on, but I do think that we'll see more drier conditions during the late morning and afternoon hours for Saturday and still expecting light freezing rain. Now Saturday night into Sunday, significant icing could be possible. Traveling is discouraged. It's going to be a headache if, if you go out on the roads and you get on top of this ice. You will have to take it slow as well. This is going to be a messy weekend. That ice storm warning again has been issued for Kansas City starting at noon today and lasting through Saturday and Sunday. So that's what we're dealing with over this weekend of January. So tomorrow a high near 31 and then Sunday a high near 35. That will allow that freezing rain Sunday morning to uh, switch over to the form of rain. Martin Luther King Day, 80% chance of rain with a high of 50 and we'll begin to see those warmer temperatures last throughout the next parts of next week.